Hi, I'm Matt Hillebrand with Don's Appliances. You had an appliance just break. Now what? You've got a six-year-old refrigerator that is just broken. You're upset. You've got to buy a new one. Appliances aren't lasting the way they used to. You have an old 40-year-old refrigerator in the basement that continues to work, no issues. But that six-year-old refrigerator with all the bells and whistles just broke down. Stick till the end and we're going to show you that you're not losing money. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through a quick exercise here on this whiteboard. And I'm going to just go through and talk about a lifespan of your 40-year-old refrigerator and your six-year-old refrigerator and show you the dollars and cents. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put our 40-year-old refrigerator. That refrigerator has what we call a piston-driven compressor. This type of compressor works on average two to three hours a day. This refrigerator, on average, uses $112 a year. And that's a number just we're arbitrarily pulling from some of the old energy tags that we had found. So if your refrigerator is going to operate $112 a year, it's going to run two to three hours a day. So we'll say three hours a day, seven days a week. Okay. And that would be three hours a day, seven days a week, you're at 21 hours a week times 52 weeks. Apologize, my writing's going all over the board. We're just kind of having fun with this. So I'm going to pull out a calculator, 21 times 52. So that refrigerator yearly is going to run a thousand 92 hours a year. And then what I'm going to do real quick, I'm going to multiply this by 40 for the years. Okay? Times 40. So this is going to come out to 43,680 hours of operation. Again, apologize for the handwriting. So that's, that's quite a bit of time. Now, let's go back up to this number, the $112 a year. Let's multiply that by 40. So this refrigerator cost you $4,480. Now, Depending on the age of the refrigerator, this is probably a low number, so I just wanted to preface that. So, like I said, $112, and depending on the cubic footage, et cetera. So the $112 is just an arbitrary number just for this comparison. So now, let's go through, this is a, a 40-year-old refrigerator. So let's go through and look at a, a six-year-old refrigerator, okay? So this is a rotary compressor. So what that means is that this really doesn't power off or shut down that often. It actually powers down, it does not shut off. So what you'll have is when, when needed, the compressor will kick on to high to cool down the unit. So this will operate 19 to 21 hours a day. Okay? And this is $60 a year. This is an Energy Star refrigerator, okay? So now let's go through. So if that's operating, we'll say 21 hours a day. We'll just put a little hour there. Times seven days a week. It's 147 hours during the week, total, total weekly, 
times 52 weeks. And I'm going to have to pull the calculator out on this one. So real quick, we'll pull that out. 147 times 52. That's going to be 7,644. Make that a little hours a year. And then we're upset. This only lasted six years. We'll multiply that by six. So this actually operated in that six years, 45,864 hours. And if I compare this to this, in 40 years, your refrigerator in the basement has operated less than what your six-year-old refrigerator has done. So yes, you are upset that the six-year-old refrigerator conked out before your 40-year-old, but there's a lot of things going on. And number one, this has been much, much, much this has been used much more in terms of operational hours than your old unit. The other thing to consider is at $60 a year times six, this cost you $360 to operate in energy. Compare that to $4,480. And again, this is probably a low number because we're using just $112. So if I compare that, and you continue to use that refrigerator in the basement, you're gonna be paying out of pocket a lot more in electricity. But what it comes down to is, there's a, there's a convenience factor, and there's a point that a refrigerator only lasted six years. Compar good comparison would be driving a three-year-old car 200,000 miles, right? It's still only a three-year-old car, and it only lasted three years, but you drove it for 200,000 miles. You have a six-year-old refrigerator that's been in operation for 45,000 hours, almost 46,000 hours. That's cost you $360 in electricity. Now, there is the upfront cost, so we'll say, okay, it was a $2,500 refrigerator. Okay, so total would be what twenty eight sixty is what this refrigerator costs if you add the usage of energy cost of the unit total of twenty eight sixty. It's still far less than what that refrigerator in the basement. It's almost two times the difference. So when you look at and you think about having to replace a six year old refrigerator. Folks, it's not a bad idea because it served its time, okay? It's operated for 45,000 hours. So if you get six years to 10 years, you're doing extremely well. Don't be upset. It's just a big inconvenience. Thank you for watching. We'd love to hear your comments below. Let us know if you liked our comparison. It's kind of uh, quick. It's kind of messy, again, because my handwriting isn't the best but we appreciate you taking the time to listen. Thank you.